Hi, in this particular video we're going to be looking at expanding brackets. Now this is the first video in a playlist. It does get progressively more difficult but we're going to start with this particular type of question which is about two marks at uh, grade C, round about level four at GCSE. So really all we're looking at is saying we've got two bracketed terms and we want to expand and simplify them. Okay, so if we look at um, the first term, we've got x plus 5, and we're going to multiply it by x minus 1. Well, for the moment, just completely ignore the plus 5 bit. In fact, actually, we'll take that out. If we take that out, what we're going to do then is multiply each of these two terms inside the bracket by the x. Okay, so the first one is going to be x times x, which is x squared. And the next one is going to be minus 1x. OK, so in terms of the first bit of this type of problem, the, that's been taken care of by just multiplying through by x. So the next bit is to multiply through by the positive 5. OK, so we're going to do that. So we've got plus 5 times 6 is plus 5x. And then we've got plus 5 times minus 1. Well, a positive times a negative is a negative, and 5 times 1 is minus 5. OK, so that's really what you should be getting, and then it's just a case of tidying that up and making it look a bit more presentable. So what we do is we call it gathering the like terms. Well, the first term is x squared, and that stands on its own because it's a term all of its own. The next one is minus 1x and plus 5x. Well, minus 1 plus 5 is going to be plus 4. So this will become plus 4x, and then we've got minus 5 at the end, minus 5. OK, I hope that's been OK for you. There is another way of doing this particular way I use it. I think they call it crab claws or something like that. Uh, there is another way which is called the grid method, and I will add a video about that. Um, however, at the higher level, it's kind of easier if you learn it this way, and you'll find it a bit more, a uh, bit easier when you come to the higher level questions towards the end of this playlist. I hope that's OK. We look forward to seeing you inside the next video. Thank you.